Lava 60. Psalm 120. In my distress I cry to the Lord that he may answer me. Deliver me, O Lord, from lying lips, from a deceitful tongue. What should be given to you and what more should be done to you, you deceitful tongue? A warrior's sharp arrows will glow on coals of a broom tree. Woe is me that I sojourn in Meshech, that I dwell among the tents of Kedar. Too long have I had my dwelling among those who hate peace. I am for peace, but when I speak, they are for war. Genesis six eleven. Now the earth was corrupt in God's sight, and the earth was filled with violence. And God saw the earth, and behold, it was corrupt, for all flesh had a corrupt way upon the earth. So on. So God's obviously for peace. And in the days of Noah. There was a lot of violence in the world. And that psalm I read, I am for peace, but when, when they speak, they are for war. God's obviously for peace. Doesn't like violence, does God? Doesn't like aggr aggression and aggravation. So God tells Adam, don't disobey him. And tells Cain, don't sin. It says, no is righteous. And that Babel divides the pride. So you don't pursue a pride system of life. A regular, normal, down to earth, grounded, scripturally based, sober, humble life. And when you're building up your Tower of Babel, remember God divides the pride, scatters it amongst the nations.